Hello Nabil, how are you? I am fine and you? I am fine too. How did you feel when the earthquake shook the whole city? Oh, yes, I was terrified with the tremor. I just can't forget the shaking of the earth. I can understand what happened to you. Oh, my god, that must have been a disastrous moment of my life. What were you doing at that time? I was in my reading room when the tremor started. I took shelter under my table in fear and I was there till the tremors were going on. You did the right thing. I was also in my reading room when it happened. Some of my neighbors were so scared that one of them fell down on the stair. Oh, it is terrible. First the earthquake, and then that accident. Was she badly hurt? No, she bumped her head only. So, we gave her ice. She was quite well after some time. But that got me thinking how safe will we remain in the event of a major earthquake. Oh, yes, think about the buildings of this city. The builders hardly follow any code of construction. You are right. Most of the buildings of the city may collapse during an earthquake of a magnitude of 7 to 8 on the Richter scale. Oh, my god, I can't even think about the people in them. Can you guess what will happen to them? Yes, it will cause heavy loss of lives and properties. The authority should strictly develop a code for construction of buildings to minimize the losses. Yes, and all buildings should follow the code for construction is mandatory. Thank you very much for such a nice discussion. I think my destination reached, goodbye. You are most welcome, bye and see you.